Greg, talk about the way you've absolutely turned it on here the last few weeks and become a sack machine, really. Um, really just relentless effort and running to the ball like Coach Diaz and Coach Baker always preach and Coach Stroud just giving it your all out there and just playing with 10 other dogs really helps you out a lot of things. In my way, I just feel blessed out there sometimes because some, somebody else might cause a quarterback like flushing to come my way and it's just, just great. Having those guys out there with me is really a blessing. You obviously got four yourself, but the other guys got five too. So you know, nine as a team, just for everybody else to eat, like Coach Diaz said. Yeah, man, it's great. It it, it really feels good when all the work you put on, um, all the work you put in pays off. Because we go out there and green tree work every single day, even though sometimes things don't go our way, we're always still working. We always come back, and we always try to compete every single Saturday the best we can. The win, uh, just to come up here and dominate, you know, Florida State. What, what does that mean to you guys as a team? Uh, it's great. It's great. We needed that momentum. We played a solid game, I think, in all three phases. I'm just so happy. I'm just so happy for the coaches, the, uh, those guys in the locker room, just the whole entire program as a whole. What's made the difference for you? Uh, you know, these last few weeks is it just the culmination of a lot of work you put in, or, or you know, you're a different player these last few weeks? Uh, I don't feel like I'm a different player. I feel like I'm doing the same thing. I mean, sometimes like things are going my way. Like I have the stats and stuff, but I never like during the season said, let me work harder or let me turn it up or anything. I'm just going out there and just competing every single Saturday. I don't really change anything I do in practice or any moves or any of that. You have double digit sacks now for the season. Is that something at the start of the year you could have imagined or foreseen? Uh, I mean, saying? it's a blessing. I never really like put a number on it or anything or like just or thought about it. I just thought about just winning every single practice and every single game that game that we play and whatever happens just happens. It's 12 now, it's more than Calais Campbell, who I know is one of the guys you look up to. Yeah, pretty cool. <laughs> Do you text with him, with Calais? Oh yeah, sometimes on Instagram, yeah, sometimes. You gonna tell him you beat his number? <laughs> <laughs> Anything else, Greg? All right, thank, thank you. you.